We have eight chicks that were recently put on exhibit. We had all worked so hard to raise them and, and make sure that they were healthy and ready to go on exhibit. And it is, you know, it's, it's kind of like the kids' first day at school. My name is Susan Cardillo. I'm the assistant curator at the Central Park Zoo. They were roughly two and a half to three months old when we put them on exhibit. They were uh, very excited to have more space, more room, and to see other penguins, it seemed, but um, they were also a little uh, wary of their surroundings. The colony saw them come, and they did go right towards them, check them out. Well, at first, it's a standoff. Then one will chase the other, and depending on how the other reacts, either they, they're willing to get chased or they'll chase them back. And then it's all over in a few minutes. <laughs> It's actually really important for the chicks to learn that behavior because that's behavior they're going to need to protect themselves and to establish themselves. There's not a whole lot of beach area, which is also true of their natural environment in the wild. So they have to learn how to um, jump out of the water and land on, on the surface, the rocks. And it, it took them a good 24 hours to learn that, to master it. Uh, um, it, was, it was humorous watching them make their first attempts because um, they failed a few times, and then they got it. In just a matter of a few days, um, they, they were very well aware of their social status in the colony, and they established their territories. Um, they are fully integrated now. They, you wouldn't even tell who the babies were from the adults. Um, they behave just the same. And other than their, um, the color of their bands, they look like everyone else. This was a huge undertaking. Um, we've never done this before. This is the first time we've hand raised eight penguin chicks. Everyone worked overtime up until the very last day, and everything went very, very well. We're really pleased to see that.